Hello everyone, welcome to the Calamity Death Mode Guide to Duke Fishron. Now, at this stage of the game, we're post-Golem. We have a lot of weapon and armors to choose from. You can choose from either Hydrothermic, Plaguebringer armor, or the uh, Hollowed armor. I prefer to go Hydrothermic or Plague Reaper. Doesn't really matter. Um, Elf Melter, the Blossom Flux, and the Hellstorm, I think, are great weapons to use. I'm going to use the Elf Melter because it's basically overpowered. Um, the accessories are Angel Treads, Asgard's Valor, Ranger Emblem, Hero Shield, Deadshot Brooch, the Amalgamated Brain. Now, one thing to keep in mind with the Prague Reaper armor is you get this 10% increased damage when enemies are inflicted by the Plague. And some people like to use the Alchemical Chemical Flask. Um... I don't really want to do that because, especially with the Amalgamated Brain, I already get that 10% increased damage, and I get the ability to dodge and confuse enemies. So, that's just why I'm using the Amalgamated Brain over the uh, Chemical Flask in this situation. But anyways, let's get going. <laughs> starts out with dash, then he moves to two dashes, then he moves to three dashes. This one will be one, two, three. risky because you miss he will deal massive damage. We can get him in like these kind of loops. Where he's just kind of going up and down in this last phase where he's just dashing constantly. As you can see, though, if you're paying attention to the DPS meter, the Elf Melter is just probably the best weapon at this stage. It's just the damage is so far. I don't even know why it does this much damage. It's so far above any other weapon that I've seen. Uh, so that's it for Death Mode Duke Fishron. Hope it helped.